All right, guys, let's watch this and talk about it after. He told me some days ago that your accountant will be resigning from his job, right? So I thought to myself, since I'm a chartered accountant, why don't I come up with an option of this same accountant of yours? <laughs> no. So I brought this. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you, you see, you see, I mean, the company's policy for recruitment or, I mean, for employment, uh, the policy says no family member, I mean, no close associate, no family friends, no relatives, nothing. So it's not going to fly. You're my wife. It can't work. Are you serious, Nelson? Yes, I am. This is my husband's company. You have the right to fire and hire. So why would you tell me that you cannot take me for a position in your company? Where do you want me to go to? <clears throat> so that's it. If you're looking for a job, I will definitely get you a job. Right? I'll get you a job. I'll go through my contacts. I have friends. I have friends everywhere. I'll go through my contacts and I'll contact one or two of my friends. And I'll tell them I need a job for my wife. And definitely I'll get you a job. But working in this company... TKD? No, it is not going to work. Have you lost your manners? You have the guts. So come to my office, seeking for a job without informing me. Huh? Boldly! You walked into my office seeking for a job. Didn't we sleep in this house together? Did I not wake up from this house before going to work? I mean, why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you inform me you were coming to my office? You know, Nelson, at times when you talk, I, I wonder if you're actually the one talking or something is talking to you. I, 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 you stupid. Are you okay? I, 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 are you mad? Huh? Are you mad? Do you know who you're talking to? Me, Nelson, the CEO of TKD's Holdings. You, you're talking to me. You have the guts to talk to me like that. What the hell is going on here? Who are you? Who are you? Well, since you want to know, I want his wife. And who the hell are you? Ask him. I'm not going to talk. And you, don't go to the there. Tell me who the hell you are, what is your team? It hasn't got into that yet. Can you listen to me? It hasn't got into that yet. It hasn't. Now you tell me which way. You are talking to me. Nelson, you just called me my name in front of that, that idiot. That demented buffalo. You just called my name in front of her. What are you doing in my office? So now I have to take permission from my husband before I come to see him in the office, right? All right, guys, let's talk about this one completely. Um, you know, there's always two sides to every story, you know, um, with many, uh, many relationships. Anytime a man does something, uh, you know, the wife might always wonder if they're doing it for, you know, uh, the right reasons or if it's for the wrong reasons. And I'll leave you guys to go and watch this movie and, you know, maybe decide if the guy threw out the whole policy of no hiring of, um, you know, family members just because he wanted to keep his affair going on. I'm going to let you guys go and watch the movie and, you know, find that out for yourself. But today for this movie, we're going to be talking about the issue of, you know, husband and wife working together. You know, um, me personally growing up, uh, my dad and my mom worked at the same hospital. Uh, it's a little different in the sense that my dad was the, you know, managing medical director of the whole hospital and my mom was a nurse in the hospital. Now, they already met and married before they started working there. So it wasn't like a situation where they met each other there. You know, and I, it didn't seem like there was a problem with it. More fact, it seems like he made it a little easier in the morning when, you know, we're leaving for work. So... You know, uh, you know, they could go with the same car, except if there's something they need to do in between and stuff like that. It kind of felt like uh, it was perfect, you know, for the whole morning commute. 
it's not the same thing with many jobs or many relationships there's relationships where uh you know the man doesn't want the woman to work with him uh, and you know in most cases i've heard people especially guys make arguments like they don't want to be seeing her every day or they don't want to be seeing her 24 7 you know so uh, them working together is definitely going to create that instead of them being apart they are also now together at work besides whether it's a policy or not because we're not discussing that i don't see anything wrong now definitely it's always good if people get their space if they need it you know and some people do need it based on maybe the kind of work they do or how they were brought up so some people do need that little space where you know they're unhinged uh, they you know don't have to see somebody but i still think that it boils down to the kind of relationship you have with the woman if you are like a fun going and open-minded person you know sometimes there's nothing that she will be preventing you from doing while you know at work at work for instance if there's you know hanging out with the guys you're hanging out with the guys if you're chit chatting at office you know you can come by see how she's doing move forward continue what you're doing or whatnot now of course if one person is always getting into trouble at work then yeah i can see the reason why the other person will now get embarrassed uh, that their spouse is always causing trouble so you know they're always the topic but if that's not the case it's everywhere it's calm everybody's doing their job i don't see anything wrong with it now if you're dealing with a spouse that you know feels like they need space away from you and you know quite frankly it, it doesn't have to do with you know trying to see somebody on the side or cheating of any kind then maybe you guys although you're still working together can still figure out how to coexist there without being in each other's face all the time because you know quite frankly you guys are not going to be sitting in the same office so you know they will have their own you will have your own department probably two separate places and might never even see the whole day uh, depending on how big uh, the company is but when it really comes to the ability to coexist uh, at a workspace while also being married and you know coexisting on the home front i think it's very possible i think it's very possible and i don't think it takes anything away from the relationship uh, it keeps you guys really bonded as far as i'm concerned if you love this spouse of yours you know it keeps you guys bonded keeps you guys uh, you know into each other more uh, and of course you know because you're not walking next next seats to the, you know your spouse uh, you guys still gonna have a lot of moments where you're not together a lot you know the whole day might go through and you're not even seeing besides two of you coming to the office together and you know i i think it's okay the experience i had growing up was perfect you know didn't seem like anything was wrong with it i know times have changed since then and uh, people have changed uh, there's a lot of things that you see on social media and you know you base your own personal situation based on you know what you see on social media you know and i get it so you know if the case is something that might you know you feel like okay you've seen this happen to maybe a friend a colleague or somebody you know online you don't want such a situation to also happen in your relationship then maybe that's something you guys should talk about see if it's something that will apply to you guys whether it makes sense or not you know before your wife or your husband joins you in the same company but that's about it for this one guys uh you know i want to hear your comments on this if you guys feel like uh there's a different side to this story that should be factored in you know drop it down in the comments uh, also go and watch this movie title again is complete me and um you know the link would be below uh, so you don't even have to go and search for the movie if you love this kind of content please like share follow subscribe this is cj and i'm here to do